Hello everyone. In this video we're going to be solving an exponential equation. We have 2 to the power x squared divided by 4 to the power x equals 256. Let's go ahead and write the 4 as 2 to the second power and 256 as 2 to the eighth power. That gives us the following. 2 to the power x squared divided by 2 squared to the power x equals 2 to the power 8. Now from here we can get 2 to the x squared multiply the exponents 2 times x that is 2 to the power 2x equals 2 to the power 8 and then now since we have division we can go ahead and subtract the exponents and that gives us 2 to the power x squared minus 2x equals 2 to the power 8. Since we have the same base and the base is different from 1 or negative 1, we can safely say that the exponents are equal. This implies x squared minus 2x equals 8. And that implies a quadratic equation, x squared minus 2x minus 8 equals 0. Now this is factorable into two linear factors negative 4 and 2 are two numbers we're looking for and now we can write this as x minus 4 times x plus 2 equals 0 and from here we get two solutions for x x equals negative 4 I mean positive 4 and x equals negative 2 let's go ahead and check the original equation is 2 to the power x squared divided by 4 to the power x equals 256. If we, if we replace x with 4, we get 2 to the power 16 divided by 4 to the power 4, which is 2 to the power 16 divided by 2 to the 8th, and that is 2 to the 8th, and that is 256. If x is equal to negative 2, we get 2 to the power 4 divided by 4 to the power negative 2. This is basically 2 to the 4 divided by 2 to the power negative 4, which is 2 to the 8th, and that is equal to 256. So both of the solutions check, and they should because we didn't really square any size or there is no domain problem. Everything looks positive. So let's go ahead and take a look at the graph, and we'll finish up. So here's the graph of 2 to the power x squared minus 2x. I kind of uh, simplified this for you and set it equal to... 256 and you don't see 256 because that would need a lot of zooming out but you get the idea we actually have uh, a figure that is symmetrical with respect to uh, x equals 1 because that would kind of look like a parabola this is 2 to the power x minus 1 squared minus 1 and this brings us to the end of this video thank you for watching i hope you enjoyed it please let me know don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. I'll see you tomorrow with another video. Until then, be safe, take care, and bye-bye.